One of my favourite regions in Spain is the northwestern tip, just along the Atlantic coast. You get these beautiful, fragrant, espresso wines. And what I have here is a wine from a quite unusual and lesser known grape called Maranzetto. Uh, it's produced by a producer here, you can see it's quite a cool label, quite a cool name, uh, Fidelo do Cutos. Uh, Fidelo uh, literally translates as brats like bold kids. So it's the bold kids of Cuto. And um, they make really, really interesting wines. They farm really ethically, uh, biodynamically. And this is a fab uh, grape called Maranza, which you don't see very often. Uh, perfect for lovers of Pinot, Pinot Noir. And you can probably see, oh, it smells really, it's really exciting actually. I know Pinot would be my favorite red grape, so this is um, right up my alley. You can probably see the color, it's very, very light. And on the nose, you've got spicy red fruit, cherries, loads of layers. It's, it's really amazing when you get a wine and as soon as you smell it, it tastes alive. And that's, jumps out of the glass. Um, this wine as well, it's produced in quite limited quantities. So it's one of those that um, if it's available on the website, it's definitely worth getting if, if nice Pinot is up your street. And what I would also say about this one is that when you're shopping for red wine in Burgundy, it tends to be quite pricey. This offers a really good alternative to more affordable, high quality style of wine like that. Yummy. So that's Fidelita Cusas Bastarda.